Caitlin Clark had an amazing year and is nominated for three awards. Caitlin, you are the Larry Bird in that you are an amazing player. You have ties to Indiana, and white people are really crazy about you. This year's recipient of the Jimmy V Award for Perseverance epitomizes that notion and embodies the inspiration for the award itself. Please welcome the recipient of the Jimmy V Award for Perseverance, Dawn Staley. Thank you. Well, I'll, I'll lighten the mood a little bit. Um, I had to wear these glasses because I, I have to see the teleprompter, and now I understand why they call me auntie now. <laughs> but thank you. Thank you all. I am profoundly honored and deeply moved to stand before you today accepting this prestigious award. But I must confess, I feel a little undeserving of this recognition. Past recipients of the Jimmy V Perseverance Award have faced incredible challenges and proven themselves as true warriors. I have merely been a spectator to such immense courage and resilience. Last week marked the first anniversary of the passing of my good friend, assistant coach, and Olympic teammate, Nikki McCray Pinson, whose story you just heard here. You also heard the powerful stories of my sister, Tracy, and Blakely Thompson. That sweet little girl is fighting cancer with all of her might. I'm wearing the necklaces tonight. If they can stand strong in the rings with unwavering bravery and go toe to toe with only faith as their armor, how can I not? It's the fight for me, the unwillingness to give up or to quit. I think that's why I stand here today. I'm not the one to back down and I don't give up. And believe me, I'm not perfect. I still clap back at people who troll me on social media. <laughs> I can't help myself, but I'm working on it. You have the power to make a difference. You can stand up for what is right. You can inspire, motivate, and help others. All it takes is the will to do so. Pay it forward. Do the right thing, even if it's the hard thing. And when they start to troll you on social media, tell them to come see me. <laughs> Thank you. God bless. I'm now going to present the best WNBA player SB presented by AT&T. Yeah, we told you we had some awards on the yeah. show. Let's take a look at the nominees really fast before we announce the winner, which is currently in my hand. So the nominees are, no surprise here, we got Nafisa Collier yes. of the Minnesota Lynx. Brianna Stewart of the New York Liberty, Alyssa Thomas of the Connecticut Sun, and Asia Wilson. There they are. Yes. Right here. Let's take a look at these beautiful faces. That's a great, four, great group. Yeah, I was going to say four very Seriously. worthy yeah. nominees. I mean, but only one can win. So let's take a look at the winner right now. Harry, I need another drum roll, please. Is that a good drum roll? Is there a better way I could do that? Uh, if you had actual drums. Did the winner did is Asia Wilson of the Las Vegas Aces. And the SB goes too. South Carolina Gamecock. Oh my gosh. My heart's beating fast. But who knew Dawn's daycare would be up here right now? Glory to God and um Thank you for the love and the support from everyone. We appreciate you guys. And go Gamecock. Let's take a look 
really fast at the nominees. Just unbelievable, one of the best in the country. The sports all-time leading scorer. One of the best basketball players that the women's scene has ever seen. And Franklin with the kill. Time and time again. The best gymnast in the country. Nobody does it like Haley Bryant. You have the winner of this award right here. Drum roll, please. Let's see it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And the winner for Best College Athlete Women's Sports presented by Athleta is Caitlin Clark, ladies and gentlemen. I am surprised shocked. there, probably. I, it, it blows me away. I had no idea that it was <laughs> yeah. Caitlin Clark. I had no idea that all yeah. those records were just. That she yeah. Broke. She's yeah, honestly yeah. a real underdog. Yeah, yeah I know. You know? I'm, I'm very surprised. I mean, honestly, uh, Caitlin Clark has done so much not only for women's college basketball, obviously, what she's doing in the WNBA, but just women's sports in general. So she's been huge for the entirety of everything that we've seen on the women's side of the game. What I love about her is that she is causing so many discussions around the women's game. Yes. Just However you feel about it, whatever side you're on about it, you're talking about it. And that's what we've always wanted. To scale up, there's going to be discussion. There's going to be controversy. There's going to be people with opinions, and that's exactly what we want. Caitlin does that, and she's great at basketball, too. Yeah, for sure. It's great to watch her. Yeah, she's Hey, everyone. It's Caitlin Clark. I just wanted to say thank you for this recognition. Obviously, I could not be there tonight. I'm a little bit busy in Indianapolis, um, but this award means a lot not only to myself, but to my teammates and coaches that I had at the University of Iowa. Um, it's special for all of us, and a special year in women's athletics. Um, so thank you, ESPN. I uh, just want to give a shout out to all the nominees and award winners tonight. Um, I'm sad I couldn't be there, but I hope you all have it. And the SB goes to... Oh, man. They not like us. Do <laughs> you like it? Uh, this is crazy. Um, first, I want to thank my parents, uh, my family, uh, my teammates, and my coaches. I wouldn't be able to do it without you guys. Uh, it really takes a village. Um, and last of all, I want to thank uh, all the great, powerful women who came before me that made this possible. Um, I share this with all you guys, so, so thank you. 